Hi friends, this is Chris with Josephine's Designs. We are on our last video of the series. I am so thankful, so grateful to our friend. At this point, when this video comes up, hopefully I'll already have begun using some of these supplies. So I'm excited, I want to film this portion first, and then as we go through the summer into the fall, I'll be using so much of these supplies for projects with us. And we're starting to get a shadow in here because all of a sudden it's cutting so dark outside. Now. We're not complaining. That helps it not be so hot. We've had 100 plus days here already. We literally jumped literally like 20 degrees in two weeks. My husband and I were talking about that this weekend. And the heat index is off the chart because we had all that rain. And yet now all of our plants are expecting all that rain. And they're dying as quick as can be. And tomatoes aren't making it. They can't handle that kind of heat. So I have just been, I've been like, what is going on with all my tomatoes? And that's what's going on. So um, my sweet husband and youngest sweet daughter were out there um, water lining. They got everything water lined but the porch again. But they promised me they're going to get it done. We have to have it done before we leave. And I really needed that first, but it's all right. We're going to get there. Um, but I'm um, just pray. I've asked for like three years, I think. And I was the one who bought all the water lining right before the pandemic. So yes, it's been a lot of years for my porch. Yes, but that's okay. We're going to get there. Um, so, um, but, um, it's gotten dark. So if you have a few shadows, that's what's happening. All right, friends, I am back. I am going to now share with you my last fun haul. This one is retro washi. Yes. I just was like, what? <laughs> and I saw this and I thought, oh, because I was going to do all this retro stuff and I ended up not. But um, I somehow missed putting this back in my cart. <laughs> it wasn't part of the order, so it was fine. But it was just one of those things when I got through and I thought, ooh, now I got to go find all my retro scrapbooking paper. <laughs> Though the colors in this are very um, dark in comparison, but they are so stinking cute. So number one, I don't know if you guys can see this, but look at the gals on this. They are retro. I'm going to pull this out because this is one, it is not your typical vintage washi. So I am going to show you guys if I can find the end of it. Oh, goodness gracious. Maybe it's the other way. Let me try this way. But I just could not believe how cute this washi was, and I cannot, oh, there it is. I cannot find the end. But guys, part of that is, you know, my eyes are so goofy. But we're getting there. But look at that washi. Isn't that the cutest thing you've ever seen? Oh, goodness. So, and I took a break in between the last video and this one because everybody came in. They're hot, they're tired. And then um, our VBS, I was getting like message after message after message. I was like, who is that? I realized it's our VBS. So um, I am blessed to get to participate in our church's VBS this year. And um, if you have little ones or grandchildren, I hope they're going to be in VBS this summer. And this is just retro labels. Isn't that cute? Um, and then our patches and labels. And oh, goodness, that's so cute. And then this one is retro ads or signs. But um, I was just getting tons and tons of messages, and then I have one from a family, and so I love this one. I think this one is gorgeous. It's so bright and bold. Um, it is. It is not. It is very. Um, um, it's not see through, you know. So I like that. It's more opaque. And now this one is more see through, and it's still pretty. I mean, I love this. I'm not saying I don't, but every now and then on these retros, I really like it when they have more coloring and they're more backed and you can see them boy i can't find the end on this one again got here we go wow you know sometimes hard they just blend right in you know and this one is a little feels thinner to me so i'm going to take my time to open this up so i don't mess it up but um they feel very sticky which is nice because some washi cannot be sticky look at that isn't that fun but ah. Uh, so again, these are all Amazon bargain finds for journaling, memory keeping, paper crafting, however you want to use it. So you guys know how much I love my vintage ladies, but these are a little bit taller and these are, the other ones are more wa uh, washi paper style. They're stickers, of course, or you can keep the backing on them and then you have the option of them being 
um, not a see-through, but these are clearly stickers, and I love these. So you have this color, which is kind of a violet, and I'm not going to open these because you can see just what I'm doing. Then you've got the reds, and they're just a little bit taller than what I've used in the past. And then look at this. This one is kind of pinks and reds. I love that. With some other colors in there, which I love as well. And so that was darker. This one's lighter. And then you've got the yellows. Isn't that cute? I love these. I hope I'm not going too fast. And then you kind of have the nighttime black, you know, sophisticated, um, I think of that film noir, the black and white, you know, kind of thing. But I think that's a different kind of thought on that. But anyway, it's just that black and white. And then you have the gorgeous greens. And every one of these integrates another either black or white or gold or other colors in it. So you don't just get, like this one has like a turquoise, a light or a light teal. So very pretty, very beautiful. Um, endless resources. I hope you've enjoyed this series. I hope this encourages you to try one new thing. Try one new thing. Try the sticker ladies, like I call them, and we have all kinds of sticker ladies in this series from the first set. Um, try the all the washies. We have the beautiful decorative. We have the vintage. We have all kinds. We have the junk journal kits. We have the stickers of vintage uh, of uh, vintage valentines, and we have gorgeous botanicals. We have um, beautiful papers, small, medium, large notepads. We have vellum pads, um, and we have laser cut uh, decorations and or frames that can be used. So there's a myriad papers, envelopes to be made, journals, etc. that can be done in this series with these products. And so come on back. We're going to have a fun time this summer and fall using all this beautiful gift from one of you beautiful, beautiful, all of you are beautiful, um, La Familia here, members of our channel. And I just want to say thank you. Um, this is a blessing. My heart has been very tired this last week. And when I was sitting here today thinking, now I'm supposed to take one more day off and rest. And then I realized, nope, let's just start doing this. Let's get this going because this is my rest sometimes. So some of this will go straight into the boxes to be packed for Florida for the summer trips um, and or the other trips I'll be taking. Some of this will be immediately broken into. Hmm. Hmm. Yes, I know. And then, um, but nonetheless all of it is a blessing and i want to thank you guys thank you for being here um we're at the end of this series so tell me what was your favorite tell me something that you might try and or replicate and use i'd love to hear that too because i know people that make their own washi and it's a blast um yeah i've done that too i know i know gotta try it all right but anyway so all right friends i pray your day is blessed creative and lovely thank you so much for coming by today Again, thank you to our friend who reached out and said, would you do this? And I, I'm just so humbled and honored and grateful and um, encouraged. And I just want to say thank you. And I hope that this is encouraging everybody else. So um, I love you as much as I love you. Jesus loves you so much more. Seek God in everything you're doing and let all of our things be pleasing to him, even in our art and junk journaling. Let us just have a wonderful time fellowshipping with God as we put things on paper, memory keeping, however you're going to use this, card making, journal making, however you're going to use it. And um, yeah, amen. That's it, right guys? Okay guys, I'll be talking to you soon. Love y'all. Y'all take care. Bye now.